My name is A.G. I'm an introverted high school student who's always a loner. But one day, a gal became my fiance. She's a gal in the same class. Her name is Milan. We started dating because our parents arranged our marriage. I didn't like her at first, but after we've started dating, I found out that she was a nice girl who showed interests in my hobbies. Most of all, it seemed that she liked me since she was little. Right now, I like Milan and the fact that she was a fiancé didn't really matter. I just like her for who she is. We were on our way home from a date. That pancake was really good. Thank you for taking me there. I'll look for another good place. <laughs> to be honest, it's been a while since we've started dating, but I haven't held her hand yet. First of all, how do you hold a girl's hand? Do you do it suddenly? But what if she doesn't like it? How does Milan feel about it? I want to get to know more about Milan, but what about her? It was a day during a summer break that I felt such frustration. AG, I need a word with you. What is it, both of you? How's it going out between you and Milan? Why are you asking such a thing? Since it's you, I guess that you can't even hold her hands. Besides, you're a wimp. Did you really have to say that? But you are right. Her parents are also worried about whether it's working out between you two. We talked about it and decided to go on a trip with her parents for a week. AG, while we are out for vacation, you two have to live together in this house. What? Milan and I? <sighs> Sorry, we thought this was the only way that would help you overcome your cowardliness. <laughs> Still, you are going too far. I thought they were just kidding at first, but they weren't. A few days later, my parents and Milan's parents seriously left for vacation. And... AG, I'm looking forward to this. Me too. Life together began. I can talk to her normally when we're on a date, but when it comes to living together, I don't know what to do. Oh yeah, I haven't eaten anything since yesterday. I'll cook you something. I'll help you. It's okay, you can wait here, AG. It was the first time I saw her cook but she was unexpectedly used to cooking and I couldn't take my eyes off her. Sorry to keep you waiting. Wow, it looks good. Itadakimasu. It's so good. I'm glad. I've been practicing for today. For today? I wanted you to say my dish is delicious. Th thank you. You're not gonna eat? Yes, I'm not that hungry. I'll watch you eat. It's a bit embarrassing. Thank you for doing this. After eating, I did the dishes. In the afternoon, we watched TV, played some games, and I also spent time listening to Milan's gal's friend's love interests. Right now, Milan is in the shower. 3.141592653. Nine seven nine three two three eight four six two six four three three eight three two seven nine. I desperately tried to memorize the pi numbers I searched on my smartphone to suppress all kinds of ungentlemanly thoughts that emerged in my head. Ag, I'm out of the shower. That was quick. I got these new pajamas. What do you think? I think it looks cute. Thank you. I'm a little bit tired, so I think I'll go to bed already. Good night. I'll also go to bed after taking a bath. I took a bath, but thinking that it was the same bath that Milan used, ungentlemanly thoughts re-emerged, so I tried hard not to think. Of course, we slept in different rooms, and I was lying in my own bed. But thinking that there was a girl in the same house, I couldn't sleep. That's how our awkward life together started. And on the day we went to the grocery store together. It kind of feels like we're a married couple. Y yeah. I tried to hold her hand, but I couldn't. I was ashamed of myself. I was disappointed in myself, but there was also something else I had in my mind. Milan didn't eat that much. 
Milan cooked both breakfast and lunch, but she only took a bite or two. You are not eating much. Are you okay? Yes, I'm full. Milan only ate little and went to her bedroom early. The next morning. Milan, are you awake? Can I come in? Milan didn't get up. I got worried and decided to go check on her. <sighs> Milan! <laughs> AG. Excuse me. It's so hot! You have a fever! Milan had a high fever and I took her to the hospital right away. The doctor said she was just sick. After we received medicine, I took Milan home and called our parents. Milan, I made you some porridge. You should eat some and take some medicine. Sorry, AG. Don't be sorry. I'm the one who has to apologize for not realizing you weren't feeling well. I was looking forward to living with you. I didn't expect this to happen. Our parents won't be back for a few more days, so I'll take care of you until then. Ichi? From that day on, I cooked for Milan, helped her take her medicine, replaced the ice pillows, and wiped her sweat. My heart hurt when I saw Milan suffering. It became night. I'll go back to my room. Wait, Eiji. I feel lonely. I want you to stay with me until I go to bed. Okay. Hey, can you tell me about your favorite anime? I don't think it'll be interesting for you. I like listening to you talking about something you like. R really Um, okay. I quietly began talking about my favorite anime and also gave personal comments on it, so as not to disturb Milan from sleeping. So that's why I think that world is orbiting... Uh, Milan? Are you asleep? Milan had fallen asleep before I noticed. Still, she was breathing roughly and it looked painful. I hope you get well soon. I held Milan's warm hand. <gasps> oh no, I fell asleep! Good morning! Good morning? Oh, I'm sorry! No, it's okay! Angie's hand is soft and bigger than I thought. It, your hand is soft and so slim. Finally, I was waiting for you to hold my hand. <laughs> sorry, I got too nervous. Me too. I'm happy that we're finally holding hands. Me too. Can we just stay like this for a little while? Yes. I was happy that Milan wanted to hold hands with me too. We kept holding hands. A few days later, our parents came back from the trip and we had to get back to normal again. Milan got better and we got back to our usual life. Sorry for being late. Eiji, where should we go? I looked it up and found a nice place. We were back to normal, but there was a slight change. <laughs> <laughs>